Hey guys, so I know it's been a very long time coming, but I'm finally coming at you with this Amethyst cosplay video, and I'm so excited to share this with you guys. I'm actually going to be calling her Glamethyst because she is like a glam punk rock version of Amethyst, and I really hope you guys enjoy it. So I'm going to be starting off by using my Meron Paradise paint. And I'm using just a regular uh, makeup sponge. This is one that you can get pretty much anywhere. And I'm also using a synthetic brush. And these are water activated paints. Um, I'm actually looking for other paints to use. These are the only ones that I've tried so far. And I like how they work, but I think I could use, um, or I think I want to try to use some other ones. So if you guys know of any good face paints, then let me know. But I'm using the pastel purple shade here. And basically what I do is I'll spray inside the little pot there with some water. It's water activated so you need water to paint this on your face. And then applying it with a sponge. And this is just like a regular makeup sponge. So I'm still kind of figuring out how to use these but this is how I do it right now. And I'm sure I'll get better in the future but this is kind of how, what I'm working with at the moment. And I'll kind of fast forward this so you don't have to see me doing this for like 5 hours. <laughs> Next I'm taking my Kara Beauty palette and I'm taking the pinkish purple shade there and using that in my crease and before this I did actually prime my eyes with the Smashbox 24 hour primer just to let you guys know. Then I'm going in my crease with a darker purple shade. I'm using mainly purples for this so you'll see purple pretty much all over my face. And that's going in my crease. Next I'm taking the same shade of purple and just kind of going on the outer and inner corner. I'm doing a halo eye so it's going to be lighter on the middle of my eye and then um, darker on the inner and outer portions of my eye. So I'm taking the darker shade of purple and adding that to the inner and outer portions of my eye and then going in with the same darker purple and adding that to the bottom of my eye. I'm kind of doing like a grungy glam amethyst cosplay type of thing. You know, grungy Instagram glamorous amethyst if that makes any sense. <laughs> That's kind of what I was going for. Instaglamethyst, am I right? <laughs> oh god. So next I'm going into the middle of my eye with this white eyeshadow primer from NYX. This is their white eyeshadow base and that's just going to go on the center of my eyelid. And then blending that out with my finger. Next I'm taking the same darker purple and kind of blending out the NYX white eyeshadow base to make it not look as bold. And then going in with the lighter purple on the inner portion of my eye, the middle of my eye. Next, I'm taking my J-Cat Beauty Glitter. It's in the color Indigo, I believe. Next, I'm going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Highlighter Palette. This is the Nicole Guerrero Palette, and this color is called Forever Lit. So I'm using that on my um, brow bone. I'm also using that as a highlighter on my cheeks and on my nose as you'll see later. But next I'm taking that purple shade and using that to contour out my cheeks there. So I'm using the same purple as I did on my eyes and using that to carve out my cheeks for my contour shade. And then I'm going in with a darker purple to carve out my cheeks just a little bit more and give myself some more dimension. So 
So I'm taking the white and the purple from that eyeshadow palette, um, the lilac I guess it's called, and then using that all over my face and then going in with the white and going underneath my eye and all the highlight portions of my face so that way it looks a little bit lighter in those areas. Next, I'm going to show you how I drew my gem. So what I did is basically I went over, I drew the outline with a black eyeliner pencil and then I went in with the paradise paint again and then kind of, um, kind of formed it. I don't know. I wish I knew how to do like a realistic gem looking thing, but this is kind of what I was working with. So I kind of went along with it this way and then went over it with eyeshadows to make certain areas look a little bit darker to make it look a little more realistic. So I took my Michaels Craft Glitter and it just says glitter, it doesn't have a name brand or anything on it, I'm looking at it now. And it's called Grape Iris and using that on my gem. And then going in with my Michaels Jumbo Glitter in the color Plumberry and then using that as well on the same area. After that I'm using my Forever Lit on my cheekbones and then all the highlighted areas of my face. And then I'm going in with my Pagan Angel. This is a color from Wet n Wild, a lipstick. It's just black. I couldn't find the color that I originally used with the, um, the Amethyst look that I posted a while ago, but this one worked out pretty well. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please let me know if you have any other suggestions for when it comes to cosplaying and um, like face paints because this is one of my first attempts I want to say at using the Mar the Maron Paradise paints and I hope you guys really like the video I tried my best to embody Glamethyst as I like to call her but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and please leave me a like if you like the video share it with all your Steven Universe loving friends and I'll see you guys next time bye guys